Hello. You got a goat? I got a goat. Yeah? Yep. It's a very mature, respectable billy, and I was able to take him at 16 yards with my bow. There's a lot of weight off of my shoulders. That means you're coming home? That means I'm coming home. Twenty twenty one. Wyoming. Let the games begin. Alright guys, well it appears we've got two big body billies spotted. So that's good, always good to have options. But they're okay. quite a ways away, so we Once can't really tell there. exactly how big they truly are. We just have to go off body size and you get little glimpses of the horns and screams Billy. But it's very exciting. I just picked up six probably nannies and kids and one lone goat in a crazy place gnarly it's just cliff like what brings a goat to go there crazy we found two more billies two big 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 billies very obvious billies if we had more time in the day you could probably make a play with the boat but uh, if I had a rifle I'd be making a mad dash Good morning everybody, day two. We got a couple locations we need to go check for goats. I'm gonna go look where we saw quite a few of them, but two good ones. And then Hunter and Kenny are gonna go back to where we saw the first group. See so if we can't get them to bed up and find one in a stockable spot. All right guys, I just spotted what I believe are the two big billies from yesterday. Problem is they bedded up in the sun and I don't know how long they're gonna bed in the sun. I don't know if with the wind the way it is, if they're fine, they're gonna stay there all day or what, but I'll go get up with Hunter and Kenny, have a little chat with them. I think I have those two billies bedded in a stockable location. You do? Yeah. Okay. Huh? Let's go do it. All right, guys, the goats are still there, bedded up. So Hunter and I are gonna hop in the truck and drive around and try to put a stock on. Kenny's gonna hang back here and give us some signals if needed. We're moving in. We got Hunter up ahead. And we got Tessa, AKA Mountain Girl, who joined in. We got Kenny on the other side with some Hunter's Orange. If they move, he'll flash us and let us know they're gone. So, moving on in, baby.
fucked up. God is so good, guys. I was able to arrow a mountain goat in Wyoming. First full day. First full day. Dude. Yeah. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. Now we gotta go walk up on it. He, uh, he ended up going over a little cliff, but it's not too bad. And I think the pack out, hopefully, fingers crossed, shouldn't be too bad. I don't remember exactly where we were. Somewhere around here. We were right there. Right on the side of that rock. Yeah. And they were bedded right there. No, it hung out the back side. Uh, I saw it dangling out of it down here. Careful. So there, if you can see that rock there. Yeah. Oh, sketchy. Kind of. Poorly. What do you think? It's steep. Yeah. Yeah, that's exit. You're gonna wanna watch your legs. You're gonna probably get to that side so I don't get you in the leg. Oh. Alright guys, well we did it. It's cut up. Well, at least the hide's off. Hide's off, I'm packing that back. You can see him strapped on back there. What an incredible trip. Incredible country. Just amazing. Anyway, it's super hot, so I'm headed to get the cape on ice. Hunter's finishing. Getting them all cut up, quartered up. And him and Kenny are gonna Load up the packs and head this way. See, the trick is to record, and then you feel like you can't stop, so you just keep going. Oh, no. Even though. <laughs> Almost. Sure, you want me to carry your pack? Nope. <laughs> this is what brothers wow. and good friends are for. This is good. I hope my keys are somewhere. <laughs> well, I'm sure they're somewhere.
That's all, folks.